ladies and gentlemen i am happy to report that we got a little bit of good news coming from marvel studios so they have went to twitter and officially released their um movie schedules and as you guys can see right here on your screens this is the official list and also the official dates for the next upcoming slate of movies coming from marvel studios so we have black widow which was pushed back to November. And I think that, you know, that's probably a great time for this film, seeing as the location and everything like that has to deal with, you know, like weather conditions and winter and everything like that. So it just makes sense, you know. I would rather feel kind of, you know, a little chilly watching this film because it is definitely going to send chills down your spine when you guys find out some of the backstory behind Natasha Romanoff, aka Black Widow. The next film you have will be Marvel Studios Eternals. Now this is a take on some of the gods out there in the Marvel Universe. And this is probably how they're going to start connecting the X-Men into the Marvel Universe by starting off with the Eternals, the older people. Um, this movie is coming out February 12, 2021. Now, I don't know the original date for that one, but obviously... The situation that we are experiencing here in the great states of United States. The next film we have is Shang Chi, The Legend of the Ten Rings. Now, people may say it's called Shang Chi or Shang Chi. Everybody pronounces things differently, so please try not to attack me. But this is called The Legend of the Ten Rings, and this has been also pushed back as well. May 7th, 2021. Next we have is Spider-Man 3, I believe, and this is pushed back um, a bit later than we actually expected, but it's perfect because we want the movie to be perfect. November 5th, 2021. Next we have Thor, Love and Thunder, February 11th, 2022. Now this story is going to be crazy different. And the Thor that we're going to see in this film is going to be unlike anything we have seen so far. But I do want to say that we're not going to see the heavy big man Thor that we've seen in um, Endgame. We're going to see a different Thor. So that'll be amazing just to see. And we also get Jane back in this one as well. Um, the next film we have is Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. This is going to be a great film for you guys to watch. It'll explain a lot of things. It'll take you into a bit of like multiverse madness, obviously. March 25th, 2022. The next film we have is Black Panther 2. Now this one, there has been a lot of speculation behind it. We know the main actor who plays Black Panther, um, also known as T'Challa. Ah, T'Challa. <laughs> it's very hard for me to, you know, pronounce pronounce these names. Excuse me. Um, but Chadwick um, Boseman, um, he has lost a lot of weight recently, and there has been concerns about his mental health and his physical health and everything like that. And people are wondering if he's still going to be, you know, stable enough to play the role once again. But I think he is stable and in, in, you know, in good health from what I have seen. We didn't hear anything and I didn't see anything on Twitter, which has been my main source of information as of late. But this film set to come out May 6, 2022. And the last film we have is Captain Marvel 2, which comes out July 8th, 2022. Now, this should definitely catch us up on the current activities of Captain Marvel. Maybe after the events of Endgame, I want to say. I don't think they're going to do the whole, you know, jumping in between storylines and you know plot holes and everything like that but if you guys have enjoyed this video and are excited hit the thumbs up button and subscribe